We can begin tomorrow. Let's go to the beach. There'll be tons of people there. Plus, we got totally dried out in that desert. <laughs> That's a great idea. I forgot I hadn't gone to the beach yet. Uh, excuse me. Of course, you have to have the obligatory beach episode or beach uh, scene where everyone's in, you know, where everyone's in their swimsuits. Like, it's it's basically a, a persona tradition at this point. Let's just hope this beach thing doesn't go as badly as uh, <clears throat> a certain Persona 3 beach scene did. I'll come by tomorrow. See you then. See ya. Let me help as well. I don't have anything planned. <laughs> Thanks. We can set a schedule with everyone else depending on when they're free. Okay. <laughs> can I really do this? It'll be a disaster. <laughs> Good luck. Why me? <laughs> Stress is the enemy of beauty, you know. Back with the jackasses. Great. How can I stay calm about this? I understand how you feel. <laughs> Thanks to the incident with those hackers, people are calling us incompetent. I like how both their eyes are the exact same color. And on top of all that, the Phantom Thieves are claiming justice is on their side. Don't make me laugh. Measured was dealt with by either the Phantom Thieves themselves, or some avid supporter. <laughs> there are no tracks whatsoever, so they must be quite skilled. Either way, the general public recognizes the Phantom Thieves as the subjugating party. Damn. They're gaining support and influence much faster than we could have anticipated. It is indeed an abnormal situation. I'm beginning to suspect mass manipulation of some kind. It's even possible that a powerful person is behind them, plotting the psychotic breakdowns. If only I had realized sooner. I freaking guarantee you Akechi's the Black Mask. It's rare to hear you speak in that tone. For the sake of my justice. I won't forgive them. Yeah, screw you, Akechi. Did you see we're freaking helping people? I don't understand. Hey, I heard some people talking about us on the train home. They were saying how awesome they think the Phantom Thieves are. I heard some things too. It's becoming a very huge topic of conversation. To be Oh, goodness. Excuse me. To be fair, the casualties from a uh, medjet attack would have been massive. No surprise they revere us for preventing it. It, it was close, though. Nah, no, it's good to hear, man. Yeah, it's all thanks to Alibaba. You're a great help. It was nothing. Oh, that reminds me. Remember that stuff about ATMs and banks just stopping? That wasn't Medjet, was it? Nope, that was totally separate. So people were over overreacting to mere coincidence? Either that, or those rumors were never true to begin with. Hmm, you seem to be quite talkative with in these conversations. Is that so? Now shut up then. <laughs> I was waiting for someone to freaking start using emoticons. I don't get it, but I'm pretty sure she's angry. <laughs> you gotta apologize, Yusuke. Me? Why? Oh. <laughs> I was I was waiting for someone, because I'm like, we're texting. So, like, there should be some kind of, like, emoticon usage here, because we're all teenagers. Come on now. It's, like, a common thing. And so, finally, Futaba did it. Hey, is this really going to be okay? I'm worried about how things will be from now on. Oh, I love Futaba. She's awesome. <sighs> Training Futaba is going to be a lot of work, more than stealing someone's heart. Now the Phantom Thieves- now that's my Phantom Thieves, I knew they'd pull it off. This definitely proves the justice of the Phantom Thieves. You may be right, man. Right? It feels great. Even the guys who have been criticizing the Phantom Thieves basically have to accept them now. The news have been spreading like wildfire, too. I'll give it an extra boost on my on my site as well. I bet the approval rating will be 
through the roof tomorrow. Look forward to it. Why is he all of all people getting excited about this? Well, the news really did draw a lot of attention. I can't wait to see what happens. Yeah, let's go talk to Oya. Why not? Don't got anything else to do. You sure come here a lot, but I don't mind to just keep yourself in check. Actually, wait a minute. Please don't tell me I just like... Okay, good. Um, I want to go check out that alleyway and see if I can go talk to that. Yeah. Well, think? did you change your... Did her fate change? Yep. Fine. Fine, let's hear it. Please sit down. <laughs> her boyfriend stopped abusing her? I don't believe it. But even if he did stop, her fate should still be heading down the path to misery without changing. I mean, look. Oh. Oh. Damn. What? <laughs> the sequence of Arcana has completely changed. Death has moved far off into the future. <laughs> Hearts can be changed. Sort of trick. What are you, a scam artist? You made a deal with her boyfriend or something, didn't you? I didn't make deals. Then what did you do? Did you plunge him into Tokyo Bay or cram him into a metal drum and dump insects on him? I wish. You must have taken some sort of extreme measure. <laughs> Not capable of that stuff. do seem like just an ordinary high school kid but there's no way that could have happened without you breaking the law <laughs> I mean how could an ordinary high school student change the course of fate fine <laughs> I'm just going to have to verify your power the very power that reversed my tarot card prediction oh this is quite a serious situation for a fortune teller like me I need to get to the bottom of this you won't have to do anything. Just sit next to me while I tell fortunes. Okay. And if another unopposable fate happens to appear, then I'll test your power. I'm too busy for that. What? No! <laughs> oh, I know. I'll read your fortune. Okay. Please? I'll even prioritize your readings over my regular customers. Besides... I'll be able to provide much more accurate predictions once I get to know you better. How does that sound? Is it a deal? Hmm. <laughs> Otherwise, I won't be able to go on. Please, <laughs> I beg you. I need to know if fate truly can be changed. Alright, I guess. You will? Really? Yep. Okay then, I look forward to verifying your skills. Please don't blow me off, okay? We made a deal after all. <laughs> I like Jahaya's uh, voice actor too. She's got kind of this cute, but like, you know, mature sense to her. <clears throat> Damn, dude, you have like some ice for these bruises or something? Like, gee, Jesus, these are hurting. Unless you were lucky, there's no way you could have repeatedly done so many crimes. Or perhaps you had someone you consulted who gave you precise advice. To what you like to know. You're not getting away this time with just luck. Saw so you may be pretty, I, but in the inside you're thou ugly. Art I. It shall become the birth of the fortune pursuit. Fortune, I should have figured. I should have figured it was the fortune persona, man. Temporarily increase the growth rate of a selected social stat. That right. is freaking awesome. Is fate really something that can be changed? If it's really possible, then... Hmm. <laughs> oh, it's getting late. Let's close up shop for today. It's past your curfew. <laughs> Alrighty then. 
So how am I gonna be able to max out Kawakami's uh, stuff anymore? Since she quit her job, how am I gonna max that out? Hmm. Our master would like a word with you. Stand up straight and listen closely, inmate. Okay. It seems you freed the heart of a frenzied girl and saved her from her haunted past. Damn right. Hey, Igor, how's it going? I haven't seen you in a while. Keeping the nose long, I see. <laughs> Another step has been taken to rehabilitation. You are progressing quite nicely. By the way, did you like smoke a pack of cigarettes or something like... You don't sound too good. I remember you having this like... Kind of sound to your voice. Now, you, now you're like... There's another step. <laughs> Our master bestows words of praise upon you. You'd better feel honored. You know what, Caroline? How about I freaking get out of this cell and just punch you? Just punch you right out of the freaking... <laughs> right out of here. By the by, more curious information has found its way to your ears. A scientist's research. It seems that world may secretly be known after all. Yep. Furthermore, that very research has been stolen and is now used by those with malicious intent. Watch me say, like, oh yeah, it was totally freaking a catch use the black mask guy and it actually turns out to be that bold dude. I wonder how this will change the approach you take toward your rehabilitation. Hmm. Who stole the research? <laughs> of course, you're not gonna freaking tell me. Allow me to grant you a new power worthy of your current self. All right. Though you have my aid, be sure not to let your guard down. Otherwise, you may get swept off your feet. Okay. Feel like my bond with Igor is going deeper. I'm starting to love him. <laughs> All right. Cool. Rank seven. We shall meet again in the near future. Sounds good. To go, inmate. Yeah, screw you, Caroline. I'll just freaking stare down at you and not go at all. How about that? <laughs> Sixty percent down. Now everyone can be happy. I bet it's worldwide news. Landmark for the what? <laughs> for the ages? Destroy all evil. Won't help me, so fuck them. <laughs> Damn! I knew the Phantom Thieves would pull through. Can you believe they actually took down hackers? It's cool how they don't reveal what they're doing. Who's that guy in the that was criticizing them? Akechi? It's pretty lame to just criticize without doing anything yourself. Damn! That is messed up, but deserved. Oh, man. That is messed up, but definitely freaking deserved. Well, Makoto and Yusuke are scheduled for today, huh? I haven't seen them. What happened to them? Futaba, can you open up? Open what? The front door. Why? Won't you come to Mayoka? We're in front of Futaba's house. You want to? You want? You want to meet here and not at LeBlanc? Isn't that more comforting? You never mentioned this. It would be nice if you could hear it hurry down soon. It's scorching hot out here. You demon! Hey. <laughs> Looks like we're meeting up immediately over at Futaba's. Makoto is seriously to going about this seriously. Oh man, that's funny. You demon! <laughs> what is that? Don't worry about it. Such avant, such an avant-garde design. You have excellent taste. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get started, shall we? Well, then. What do you plan on doing? I'd like to simply have a normal conversation. That's the basis of true communication, after all. Will that be enough? She's freaking sitting like L in her chair. <laughs> I thought it would just be it would be best to start off just by learning some more about each other. Don't think too hard about our conversation. We're just going to talk about ordinary topics today. Huh? And what do you mean by ordinary topics? You know, things like food or the weather. 
Well then, let's begin with food. What do you like to eat, Futaba? Organic ones. Um, that wasn't exactly what I meant. Hmm. Let's try a different topic. How about the weather? I heard this heat wave is showing no sign of stopping. I don't know, I haven't been out. Oh, right. <laughs> Makoto's be getting overwhelmed, so she's kind of like a bit socially awkward, because, you know. This is odd, it wasn't supposed to go like this. By the way, Yusuke, have, what have you been doing this whole time? Okay. Ah, superb. <laughs> Some of their heads came off when I was moving them, so, but I made sure to rearrange them pleasingly. <laughs> wow. Good job, Yusuke. My children, what have you done to my children? They appear to be shot. They appear to be quite shoddily made. No. They're from the Phoenix Rangers Neo Featherman. No, yellow and pink's heads and red's been hacked to bits. This is all Inari's fault. Inari? Oh. According to your clothes, your thief clothes were like a fox. According to Japanese folklore, foxes are Inari, Inari Suji, thus Inari. Inari. <laughs> uh, those, they were in perfect poses too. It was so much work getting them set up just right. You wouldn't know aesthetics if it hit you in the face, Inari. Damn. How dare you say that to me of all people? <laughs> the midget in the freaking tree going at it. Sheesh, that's not a full. That's not a conversation anymore. It's a full-blown argument. Yeah. There, fixed them. I see, their versatility allows you to recreate almost any dramatic scene you can imagine. Right, mm-hmm, victory is great for action. And Neo's got the best transforming suit. Suit, So cool. Fascinating. Art depicts a flash of inspiration, but models offer a much different means of employment. Huh, take a look at that. Futaba's having a regular conversation. Seems she doesn't have a problem talking to others as long as the subject interests her. I suppose the topics I brought up weren't the right ones. So what, is this all I gotta do? What a breeze. In that case, we should advance to the next step. How about we have spend some time in someone else's room? Yes, I, she hasn't had many chances to leave the house yet, so that would be a perfect opportunity. Don't set the bar so high. We'll all be there too. Well, I guess in that case... We, I've left tomorrow to On and Ryuji. Mayoko will be there as well, so you'll be okay. <laughs> Can I wear my mask? I think it'd be best if you didn't. Man. There's really no telling how tomorrow's going to go. Yeah, with Ryuji and On, like Yusuke and, M and Makoto are a bit easier to deal with. <laughs> but Ryuji and On, man, not bad for her first time. She's still got a long way to go, though. I wonder how long before she's ready for the beach. Dude, people are so t pumped. They're talking about how the Phantom Thieves took down Medjed. Mishima's website got it has a shit ton of comments flooding in, too. The news coverage has been pretty insane as well. Yes, they've been... They have only spoken of the Phantom Thieves for the entirety of today. We've been getting attention all over the city. So how's the one who helped us take Medjed down doing? futaba -chan. My Phoenix Rangers almost met their demise. Uh... It was Yusuke's fault. No. <laughs> we just talked. Anyway, things didn't go perfectly, but it's definitely a step in the right direction. Tomorrow's goal will be to spend some time in someone else's room. Futaba is a difficult personality to handle. Good luck, you two. Shut it, Inari. Alright. It's our turn next. See ya. See ya tomorrow, Futaba. We have so much to talk about. Ooh, I can't wait. <laughs> on and Ryuji teaming up honestly worries me. <laughs> but I guess we'll see. We'll see what they can do. Oh, okay. I want to verify my skills. I have the perfect client for your test. When's a good time for you? I, you know, this will work. Let's go. 
Uh, I'll be waiting for you at my shop. I'm going to expose your so-called skills. You can't fool me. All right. Well, you can try, Jahia. You can try, but it ain't gonna work. Good evening. Hello there, Mifune Sensei. I can't wait for today's session. Your last prediction was practically perfect. By the way, um, who is this boy? Oh, you need to mind him. That's just my apprentice. Wow. If anything, you can think of him as a human-sized stuffed animal. I mean, look how fluffy his hair is. Wow. She's just taking this chance to freaking throw pot shots at me. 